guys, this is Diane at Elgin's Consignment, and today I went to Second Avenue and spent a hundred and thirty-five dollars. This is like the most I've ever spent. <laughs> That's the thrift store I usually go to, and I can't wait to share with you the things that I bought today. Let's jump right in. Here's an overview of all the wonderful things that I purchased at Second Avenue. And let's start with this right here. Um, this is a, make sure I have it, Jamboree False Graph teapot. And that is worth about um, $30, $30 um, online. This right here, and it's in really good condition. Just wanna give you, it's, it's, I want to say it's hand painted, but I'm not sure. Um, the colors are nice and bright. This right here is a Natalie Let, Letty platter, and it's an owl, and it's in really good condition. It's huge. It is worth about $35 to $55 based on the comps that I did online. There isn't any chips or any blemishes. Um, so yeah, this right here is a cruet in really good condition. No chips or cracks on it. It is an imperial glass collection and it is going to be online for $16. This right here was made for William and Sonoma. It is a vase made in Portugal in really great condition. I don't think this person used it at all. So I'm gonna sell it for $30 by now. This is San Francisco vintage carousel horse. Um, the horse spins around. The music box does work. Um, and I will have, let me see if I can twist it a little. Just a little. Yes, and it goes up and down. Um, so this right here, I'm trying to find a comp, stuck it underneath, here it is. So it's about $30 on the vintage website that I did go on and I found it for $30, one like it. This is a giraffe's head made in, Ken in Kenya and it does have the sticker, hand carved and painted. Um, this is, will be on my website on auction. I just want you to let you know that my auction, um, below price is starting at $8 from now on. The postage stamp did go up and, um, to help with the cost of gas and everything, um, my below, my starting price will start at $8. Thank you so much for understanding. This is a glass flower decant with flowers, and these flowers are gold flowers, and um, it's in beautiful condition. It does have a stopper on top. It is a decanter, um, or was made for as a decanter use, and this could be um, used as a decoration piece, which is what I would do in my household. Um, this right here is selling for $35 because it is a vintage piece. This is an art studio mug. It is signed on the bottom. It has like purplish and brown on it. I love the handle. Um, the person who did this cup really took their time to do it and it is signed. It's either mom or Marcus. My daughter and I can't figure out which one it is. This here is a Tiffany collection platter um, selling for $28 online as is. Um, and this one is in really awesome condition with these beautiful floral designs on it. Um, so the price is $28. This 
this right here is adorn egg cups um this would be great for easter it comes in a box um it looks like it's never been used and so i am going to um, put it at a higher price because it does come in a box and never been used condition um for 35 dollars so it will be the price will be around 35 dollars probably not 35 dollars this vintage Kate Finch pig made in the 1950s. Um, it is um, signed on the bottom of it. Um, and the colors are beautiful. Um, I will give it a light cleaning because it still feels a little dusty from whoever had it. And this pig will be sold at 40 $44.99 or $34.99, just depending on um, what I think is best. Um, these dish, these two um, huge dishes um, are for Cracker Barrel's use. And this right here, I will sell them between either a set for $15 or $20, just depending on what I think based on the comps I see on eBay and um, there are a few selling right now this right here is a William and Sonoma made for William and Sonoma made made in Portugal candlestick holder in excellent condition the colors are nice and vibrant it does have um, the comps on the bottom handmade um, hand painted also and the person really did an awesome job on this candlestick holder. This right here is a Temptations. And I should have picked up on this. I knew I've seen this somewhere, but I couldn't remember where. And this is a, a Temptations design um, that's on it. And this is selling for $15. Never been used. This is a Willow Tree figurine. And it's stamped on the bottom, a new dad. It's in really good condition, selling for 40 or $24. And so we're going to sell it for $14. These two mugs, um, I will sell separately. This one is in about new condition, no chips, no cracks, um, in beautiful condition. And this will be sold for about between $25 and $30. This one does have a slight um, hairline crack right here on the top of it. It doesn't look used also. Um, and so we'll probably sell it for $15. I have a iridescent glass butter dish um, in really good condition, selling on antique store for about $24. I'm not sure how much I'm going to sell it for right now. This is a Vera Bradley bag, quilted bag in great condition. The zippers and the buttons work. Um, uh, if you look inside, I don't think this person hardly used it. Um, so um, it's selling for um, $24 and higher so I'm hoping to get $20 for this bag this right here is called um, Heart, Heartwood Creek I want to say it does say Bounty Blessings hmm I'm not sure I thought that's what it said on it um, maybe it's on the bottom yeah Bounty of Blessings does have all the stickers um it doesn't look like any of the pieces are broken or anything like that i do need to go over it it is uh a 39 to 65 dollar so i'm probably going to meet you halfway and sell it for about either 50 dollars buy it as is um this is a winnie the pooh coin bank um and it, it does, it is, whoever had it, kept it in the sun. So it's a lot lighter than it should be. And so I'll be selling for $15.
This is a, another Jim Shore. This is Abigail the Cat. In awesome condition. Her whiskers are going every which way. And I will not touch it because um, I don't want to move it around too much. Um, yeah, and her tail was there. And it is stamp on the bottom. I have two amber iridescent glass. Um, they're $30 a piece. And um, this right here is a butter dish. Also, um, the same thing. It's an Iris butter dish. Um, and this is like about $24. So, yeah. So, I paid about $134. And if I sell at least a fourth of these things, I should be able to get my money back. Or... Um, even if I sell all of those things, I should double my money that I made today. So those are the things that I purchased at Second Avenue. I'm really excited to put it online so that you can have it um, or bid on it. If you have any questions about what you've seen, if you see something that you like, definitely make a comment down below and then I'll try to get back with you. Definitely go to my website, Elgin's Consignment. Um, my eBay store, Elgin Consignment Store, and also follow me on Instagram, Elgin Consignment Store. Thank you so much and have a blessed day. Bye.